hello my beautiful humans welcome back to my channel once again for those of you who don't know me i am the daring girl and i have another video for you guys and this time it is regarding all of the product that i'm currently trying out and loving please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so and remember to like this video and let's just get right into it guys <laughs> This is my first purchase from Dior and I couldn't have picked anything other than the Dior Skin Nude Air Luminizer in 003. The whole experience from walking to the counter, swatching colors, analyzing the pigment to having someone teach different techniques on applying highlighters was just unreal, really. This golden subtle shade with a hint of shimmer is just breathtaking on the skin it adds such a nice healthy glow and makes you look like you ate all of your vegetables and you've been moisturized Giorgio Armani luminous silk foundation is one of those products that I wanted to try but never took the plunge on doing so this foundation has a wonderful light glow feel to it it is stunning on the skin and would look amazing on dry skin for those of you who have oily skin such as myself, please make sure to set it with a powder. And you know what they say, set it with a powder and it will last longer. It, it blends like a dream and it still managed to look like skin. YSL to Chocolat All-in-One Glow is another luxurious brand that I couldn't resist from purchasing. I love the packaging, it's easy to carry around and throw in your makeup bag and you don't have to worry about any spilling. I was very eager to try this product. It has a different feel from anything else that I own. It's a cream to water based product and I have been using it a couple of times and I have to say this product provides amazing coverage. The fact that you don't even feel anything on your skin. But for oily skin like mine, I would recommend to set it with a powder because it becomes super oily throughout the day. While I was checking out in line at Sephora, my sister and I were looking through the grab and go section and we discovered this glow stick from Siate and the color gleam instantly fell in love. We did not purchase it but a few days later. I came back and I, and I purchased it to use it for my sister's prom look and it was just stunning and glowy on the skin. It has a slight light gold shimmer to it and I use it as a base to apply Trophy Wife from Fenty Beauty and I have to say those two work really quite well together. The Urban Decay Naked Concealer is very popular but I never took the plunge until now because I have been faithful to my favorite concealers. But I have to say that I love the color of this one because it has the perfect undertone for me and it blends so well on my skin and it's very light and comfortable on the skin. I will definitely keep you guys updated on how I feel about it but so far I would say it's good. When Rihanna decided to come out with her own makeup line, Fenty Beauty, I was one of those people who felt like life was complete. I, I would buy anything that she touches or anything that can make me look like her, honestly. But my best friend was kind enough to give me this matchstick in confetti and it is so beautiful on my skin. It will suit everyone, especially those with pale I love the light blue, purple, silver, and glitter it has to it. And I love the idea of owning a few of them due to the fact that they are magnetic. You can just stack them together and the sound is so satisfying. Which brings me to my next favorite also by Fenty Beauty and it is the Kilowatt Highlighter in Ginger Binge and Moscow Mule. I just love the packaging guys, it's so minimal and simple but yet very chic and I really like that highlighter, I don't have anything quite like it 
but I did find another use for it and do use it as a blush more than a highlight they're not too too pigmented so you still get to have control of the product and deposit it on your skin however you want still I'll stay all day liquid lipstick are something that I never regret buying because they are my favorite formula and the name does suit the collection because they do last and stay all day on the lips I love the colors and I found that they suit everyone with various undertones. I was so pleased to add this new beauty name Naughty to my collection. Please let me know if you guys would like to see a lip swatch video on all of the lip products that I have from Stella. This is something that I recently picked up from Ulta and it is by Dose of Colors. It is the Hayden Treasure Palette. And I was quite surprised by the pigment because they are very, very rich. I'm also very taken by the packaging because it's very simple and minimal. And you guys know I'm all about everything. <laughs> everything that is easy. And I do like the fact that it's very convenient for me to travel with. I also like the fact that the colors that they chose are multi-purpose. Which means I can create as many looks as I want. And never get tired of it so this is a great palette so far so this is it guys we managed to come to the end of this video together and I hope you guys did enjoy watching this video please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so and if you guys like that kind of setting please like this video and share it and I will see you guys on my next video until next time ciao